The Large Hadron Collider. Why hadrons? Okay, well, we could have called it the Large Proton Collider because the hadrons that we use at the LHC are all protons. And they're the best hadrons for the job. They're cheap, they're stable, and they're massive. They're cheap because protons are just hydrogen gas without the electrons, so they come in a bottle. And they're stable. Unlike the other hadrons, protons have the lifetime of the universe. They won't spontaneously decay into smaller particles, although most hadrons will. And they're massive, which means we can get them up to the energies of the LHC, and they'll coast at that energy for hours without radiating away their energy to the side. If we used a lightweight particle, like an electron, then that would happen, and we'd have to keep adding energy to keep it where we wanted it. But what are hadrons? Hadrons are all of the particles made of quarks. Protons are made of three quarks stuck together. So are neut neutrons using different quarks. They can be stuck together in many combinations, but in every case, the hadron's quarks are held together by exchanging gluons constantly. And at the LHC, when two protons collide, it's actually the gluons, or sometimes the quarks inside of them, which do the collision. One from each, and maybe not with all of the energy of the original proton. So by colliding protons at the LHC, the Large Proton Collider, as you now know, we get a whole range of energies of collisions, from very low energy ones where those gluons and quarks didn't happen to have very much of the energy of their protons, all the way up to the very highest energy collisions that the universe has seen since shortly after the Big Bang.